What up, everyone? Uh, this is Taiwan Hubbard with H2 Minutes, and I wanted to get on here and do a quick video for you guys, uh, breaking down these hydrogen tablets. So I just got back from the Health Optimization Summit, which uh, I was there being featured as an authority in the hydrogen space when it comes to the research and these tablets and things like this. So I was able to speak with many individuals there about hydrogen therapy. And during that time, uh, Joe Rogan featured Gary Brecca talking about hydrogen tablets. And so uh, because of that, there was quite a buzz around hydrogen tablets. Uh, and as we're going to get into hydrogen baths and these kind of things. And so I wanted to go ahead and do a quick explainer video um, because there is a lot of questions going around and people don't know and they're confused. And so I'll go ahead and walk you through it. And so I have a little outline. We're going to go through this outline and we're going to give you the basic information and then point you in the right direction when it comes to these tablets and explaining what Gary Brecker was talking about. And so this really is basically uh, hydrogen tablets and hydrogen bath bombs for explained. All right. So first and foremost, what are these tablets and that uh, Gary Brecker was talking about on the Joe Rogan podcast? These tablets are classified or known as open container hydrogen producing tablets. And that's just their classification. Um, that's how they're known. Uh, there were other different forms of hydrogen tablets that were on the market, closed container tablets, ingestible tablets, things like that. Uh, these are by far the most popular and most efficacious forms of hydrogen tablets that are on the market. And uh, this is what Gary Brecker was talking about on the podcast. And I actually have a tablet right here. And so you can see these tablets. Uh, these tablets use a elemental form of magnesium or referred to basically as the metallic form of magnesium. Uh, it's, it's essentially the raw metal form of magnesium. Uh, magnesium compounds like magnesium oxide or magnesium citrate, these compounds will not naturally produce hydrogen gas when, um, when basically placed in water, but elemental magnesium will. And so these tablets basically are a unique formula of elemental magnesium, some organic acids, and a basically some sugars, some sugar as a binder uh, to hold the tablets together. And uh, it basically allows for you to be able to conveniently produce hydrogen rich water at home. And so uh, this is not anything brand new, uh, basically alkaline. Um, alkaline earth metals or alkali metals naturally react with water to produce hydrogen gas. So you're talking about, you know, magnesium and sodium and potassium and lithium and these kind of metals, right, uh, can naturally be placed in water and produce hydrogen gas. Some are too reactive <laughs> uh, and dangerous, so you should never mess around with, you know, pure sodium. <laughs> uh, it won't work, but elemental magnesium does. So Let's see here. What else I want to cover? So anyway, basically, you can see here uh, we're going to have the chemical equation pop up on the screen. And you can see that basically um, when it comes to these tablets, you'll have one magnesium uh, atom react with two hydrogen or two water molecules. And basically what's going to be the product of that is going to be um, magnesium hydroxide, two magnesium hydroxide molecule in a basically a hydrogen molecule. And so that's basically what happens is just, you can see it in real time. Uh, and in fact, I'll just go ahead and show you guys so you can see this. So basically you take this tablet and you put it in water. And as you can already see, it is reacting to form molecular hydrogen, right? And so that's what's happening with these tablets. Uh, they can produce an effective concentration and dose within about two to three minutes uh, of reacting, and it will produce what's called dissolved hydrogen gas, which is naked, which you basically can't see to the naked eye, is nanobubbles that are too small to see, and then quasi-dissolved hydrogen gas, which is this cloud that you see that is getting formed. Uh, and this quasi-dissolved is basically nanobubbles that are too small to get out of solution, so they haven't coalesced and become a bigger bubble yet for them to get out. And so um, this is what kind of makes these tablets unique and why they're so popular. Uh, they also have been used in scientific literature. So there's, there's actually quite a few studies that are on these tablets. I mean, upwards of 20 and probably even more than 20 more that's underway. So anyway, uh, a little bit about the back, my background and how I even know these tablets is some random people probably watching this video wonder who I am. So basically 
Um, yeah, so I've been an educator in the industry and a pioneer for hydrogen therapy here in the United States for over the last uh, decade. And uh, my YouTube channel teaches around hydrogen therapy and um, basically from an evidence-based um, format. And so we always are trying to give people the scientific literature uh, on hydrogen therapy and stuff. And also I run a company called Issue Hub, which is basically like the premier spot online to shop for tested and approved hydrogen products. And so we evaluate a ton of different products on the market. And so why everybody's buzzing about these tablets is really is awesome. I've been friends with the inventor of these tablets for over eight years. And I actually been testing these tablets for more than uh, seven years. And so, um, I definitely was one of the first individuals here to be able to get my hands on this tablet and be able to test it for uh, its efficacy for hydrogen concentration in water and its effective dose of H2 that can be given. So that's my uh, kind of claim to fame when it comes to these tablets um, and been able to uh, help a lot of people with understanding the technology as well as many other technologies. Obviously, you guys see all the technology in here. But yeah, we get to we get to we, we, like, we get to test this stuff. So I guess the next thing what I'm going to go ahead and talk about is Gary Brecker talk about hydrogen bath tablets as well. And so basically hydrogen bath tablets um, are basically essentially the little tablets like you see here, these little tablets on steroids, right? Uh, they're beefed up and they um, are essentially a convenient, easy way to produce hydrogen bath at home. So you don't have to purchase one of these large, expensive, costly systems. And uh, these hydrogen bath tablets can basically, by throwing in several of these tablets, you don't just you can't just do one in a bath. You got to do many uh, or several of them uh, in a bathtub. But they can same thing that you see with the water. This tablet's already done reacting, and they could can drink this and get some H two. But uh, they essentially work the same way. Uh, you're going to react in about five minutes in a bathtub, and then you're going to be able to elevate hydrogen concentration within solution hydrogen gas, molecular hydrogen, um, the gaseous form of hydrogen in your bathtub to a therapeutic concentration now that you can soak it. And so that's how these bath tablets work. And I'll actually have a larger glass here. So that one's probably 500 milliliters of water. This is about 20, but here's one of the bath tabs. This is just one bath tab. So there's it's on, it's beefed up. You can throw this bath tab in here and you'll see it just produces a lot of hydrogen gas uh, very quickly. And um, so, yeah, so you could throw several of these in your bathtub and it will basically uh, make for a therapeutic hydrogen bath. So now Gary Brecker's bath bombs or his bath tablets will likely be bigger uh, than the current version bath tabs that are on the market. And this version I've actually been tested for more than five years. Um, and we actually have a test report on our website for these hydrogen bath tablets. So you can actually see what I tested these bath tablets at. And, uh, but basically they're gonna be bigger, gonna be even bigger, gonna be provide more hydrogen gas, but in principle, um, the basic mechanics or chemistry will be the same. So that's what's happening with these bath tablets. Uh, and the science is uh, pretty promising when it comes to hydrogen baths. They've actually seen that it has very um, good promising effects for skin disorders like eczema or psoriasis. Um, even for uh, accelerating the healing rate of soft tissue injuries, as well as um, increasing um, recovery for post-exercise, things like this. Uh, you can see some of these studies. I'm going to pop some of these studies on the screen. They'll be also in the link in the description. And yeah, so um, so yeah, there's, there's, the, there's good rationale for why you would want to take hydrogen bath. It's not just founded upon people's words, there are studies being conducted on this showing that it is promising and that it has therapeutic potential for us. And so if you really want a masterclass on these tablets, uh, look at this, by the way, look, look at this. Look how dense, <laughs> look how dense that hydrogen cloud is in this uh, about 20 ounces of water. So yeah, those, those, those bath tablets obviously make a lot of hydrogen gas. Um, so, and it's theoretically, it is still reacting by the way. It's out is right there at the bottom and it's still producing hydrogen gas. So anyway, uh, that's likely why um, the bath tabs are a good option for quick and easy upfront cost effective. Well, maybe not the most cost effective if you think about it as far as how many you have to use and all that kind of stuff. You don't have to think about that. But ultimately, 
it's a low upfront cost and you don't have to pay some kind of crazy outrageous number for a bath machine, even though those bath machines might be an option for some. So anyway, uh, if you want to take a master class in understanding what hydrogen tablets are, you should definitely watch our video, Understanding Hydrogen Tablets on HG Minutes. And secondly, if you would like to see uh, what my company has already, like the approved hydrogen tablets that my company has already tested, you can, you can go to H2 Hub, which basically provides some objective performance data and our approval status of, of, of these tablets. And in fact, Gary Brecker and his team is supposed to be sending in their tablets soon to get H2 Hub's official evaluation on these tablets. So on their tablets. So this is a exciting time for people. Uh, hydrogen therapy is getting out there some more, but I wanted to make sure I cleared the air and did an explainer video uh, breaking down what is Gary Brecker's tablets and what are hydrogen bath bombs. <laughs> uh, and uh, so that's basically what it is in a nutshell um, is these tablets. And uh, you can basically get them. They're pretty much like, like Gary said, they're pretty much about a dollar a day for some of these tablets. So they are a really good entry level upfront, a very entry, a good entry level hydrogen product um, that can give you an effective dose of hydrogen gas within solution. So yeah, so there you go. That's it. That's all I really have for you guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Check out uh, Understanding Hydrogen Tablets. It's literally the, the top video for breaking down what these tablets are and how they work from a from basically from a scientific standpoint and even showcases some of the studies. Um, and then I'll also be producing in in the near future um, understanding hydrogen baths. And so we're going to get into some of that, some of that as well. Alrighty. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Deuces. <laughs>